Halloween is such a fun holiday. We get candy, we get to dress up and walk around with our friends and family, but it's important we're also safe. Here are some safety tips. You should always remember that it's dark outside and the biggest thing that we want you to think about is, are there cars on the road? Um, can they see you? Are you gonna cross the road? And can those cars see you when you're crossing the road? Show your parents, what did you get? So we ask that you look in your bag, is there anything unwrapped or not wrapped, it's open? Um, throw that out right away. And then everything else, show your parents and ask if it's okay to eat. If your costume has a sword or a gun um, or something that could be used as a weapon, leave that at home while you're trick-or-treating. If your costume has a mask, make sure that the eye holes are big enough so that you can see all the way around you. You wanna be able to, to see if there are cars coming, if there are dogs, or if there's something in the road you could trip on. You should never go alone trick-or-treating. Either take mom or dad with you, or if you have an older sibling or a group of friends, that's always the best way to trick-or-treat. So the people that are ready to hand out candy, they generally turn their porch light on. So only trick or treat at houses with their porch light on. And if the porch light is not on, we ask that you respect the homeowner and don't ring their doorbell or knock on their door. You can only trick or treat between 6 and 8 p.m. At 6 p.m. our dispatchers set off the emergency alert and you'll hear a tornado uh, siren and you can start trick or treating. But when that tornado siren goes off at 8 p.m., we have to stop. Shelby Township Police Department wants you to have a safe and happy Halloween. Happy Halloween!